Selenexor, as the name implies, it's a selective inhibitor of uh, nuclear export. So this is a small molecule orally available and what it does is it goes and blocks the nuclear export protein CRM1 or exportin 1. So why is this important and why is it selective? So this you know chaperone molecule is responsible for exporting you know proteins from the nucleus into the cytoplasm and this specifically CRM1 or uh, exportin 1 is responsible for uh, exporting all the tumor inhibitory molecules okay tumor suppressor proteins and therefore what happens is selectively in cancer cells when you prevent the export of the tumor suppressor proteins or genes then what happens is the cell will undergo death or it is arrested now tumor suppressor proteins are not important for the normal cellular mechanism so that is why it is selective in killing the cancer cells and having effect on the cancer cells so we are all ex excited about it what is the excitement because this is a universal phenomenon it doesn't have to be in one particular cancer so the chances are this drug will be useful in many different cancer it is being tried for instance in myeloma it is making a big inroad but at the same time they are also using it in AML uh, with positive re results and they are also going into solid tumor because the mechanism is different and its toxicity is different it could be combined with the existing treatment for individual cancers so this particular molecule for instance in myeloma has been combined with uh, bortezomib has been combined with carfilzomib you know so next will be to combine with immunomodulatory molecule so this will be a very important molecule and we are all excited to see as it progresses through the development